question of the day. Did Gymshark change the Vital 2.0 material yet again? That is what we're gonna discuss in today's video. Full transparency, I wasn't originally going to do this video on the Vital. <gasps> Number one, they only released the one beautiful color. Now granted, it is stunning. This cobalt purple, marl, whatever it's called, <laughs> it's the perfect blend of rich purple and deep blue. It's stunning, really, it is. But one color, plus if you guys watch my videos, the Vital 2.0 isn't necessarily on my Mount Rushmore of Gymshark anymore like it used to be because of the material switch up over the years. 2019 Ash, obsessed with Vital. Obsessed! I literally owned one of every color. I didn't skip a Vital launch. I collected them like Pokemon cards, but then a couple years later they change up the material. I know it was great for a lot of people. I love that they fixed the band gate, but for me, didn't quite do what I needed it to do anymore. It didn't fit the same, it didn't feel the same. I didn't love it as much. So fast forward to right here, right now. Package comes in, didn't think much of it, took it out of the package, put it on, right? The second I put my one leg in it, I felt right away the difference. There was a little bit of a difference in that stretch and I felt it right away. I said, wait a minute, it ain't your mama's 2.0. So then when I actually put it on and I truly felt and saw the difference, I was like, okay, we need to do a video. Because if there are any gals out there that are like me, and you just kind of steered away from the 2.0, then this video's for you. They might be winning us back with this one, who knows? And on top of the Vital, I do have a couple more little sets that I wanted to share with you now that the cooler weather's coming around. And if you see anything that catches your eye in today's video, I do have my code AshleyG that saves you 10% off of all your Gymshark orders. It also goes towards helping out this channel, keeping these reviews and Gymshark hauls coming your way. Appreciate it so much if you do use it. Please let me know so I can personally thank you. Up next in the world of Gymshark videos, we have the new Marl Seamless that we're gonna be discussing. Have you seen it? It's live on the website as we speak. I just got it in today. Do you want a sneak peek? Okay. Oh my goodness. Check out those colors. We have light gray, greenish gray, berry gray, pink gray. Everything's got a gray undertone, kind of like my hair. Just took them out of the bag, still have the tags on them. So stay tuned, we're gonna have a full review on them. So like they usually do, Gymshark dropped the Vital in leggings, shorts, and a long sleeve. I have the leggings and the long sleeve. The focus here really is the leggings. There's a lot of similarities to the last launch. It really is the same thing. There's only one little minor difference here that actually, oddly enough, really makes all the difference for me. So I grabbed these leggings, grabbed an older pair from a few launches ago, and I did some deep diving into this material. Now, sometimes they're very generic when it comes to the material listing on the website. What I check is the physical tag. It's technically made out of the same material, but this new Vital is not made out of any recycled material. And again, this is just me going off of the tag. That is my hypothesis to why it's fitting differently. Hypothesis. If you are familiar with how recycled polyester actually feel and fit, you would notice that they have slight plasticky feel. They wrinkle. I'm super sensitive when it comes to these things. This is why I really gravitated away from the Vital 2.0. I couldn't get behind that lack of stretch, that feeling of plastic, and the obvious wrinkles that would happen in the groin area, around my kneecaps and things like that. It just got to the point where I was like, you know what? It makes a lot of sense. I actually did a review of Girlfriend Collective where they primarily use recycled materials. I love the cause. I think it's great that brands do that, but I do have to say when it comes to actually wearing them, that's not my preference because I don't like the constant wrinkling and that constant plasticky feel, but don't get it twisted. It's made using dope dyeing technology that uses less water, energy, and chemicals as part of our sustainability strategy to lower environmental impact. It's nice to see them still doing their part, okay? You can see in the overlap, there's really no wrinkle when I'm wearing these leggings. So there's a better stretch and a better molding around your body. Like the glutes specifically is where I noticed, oh my God, I don't have such a uni butt. Now I think we all know Vital's not known for being super booty enhancing. There's no scrunch bomb back there. There's only a little subtle racing contour and it's also due to the high compression as well. Now, I know that uni butts aren't the end of the world for most people. You're not really trying to flip launch your booty to anybody. You're just there to get your workout done. That's amazing. But because of this semi-new material makeup, it was a noticeable difference for me. I did a full-fledged workout in this and I was like, okay, I had a great time. <laughs> Let's party. This made me feel better about this collection. If you're brand new to the Vital family in general, this is a nice performance legging. So you're not getting that buttery soft fabric. This is something you could easily rub weights against. 
you're not gonna pill, okay? There's a lot of buttery soft leggings out there where I do one hip thrust and they're pilling all over the place. This, no, nah, you're good. This is made for performance. Other than that slight material difference, I'm not feeling any real big change in the compression of the waistband. It's still highly compressive and the legging itself is still moderate to high compression. Really good at smoothing out cellulite, holding you in. If you're somebody who likes to run, I feel like this would be great for sprints, power lifting, of course, higher intensity workouts, CrossFit, things like that. So what's cool is they made a minor tweak. For me, it fits a little bit better in certain places. Definitely my preferred material and feel when I'm lifting and moving and stretching around. I think it's a more comfortable fit, super sweat proof, and you still have a really fun dotted contour or the dipping dots as I like to call them. Sizing still the same, still sticking to my true size small. In between, I would suggest sizing up because it's pretty compressive. So that is my take on the Vital 2.0 Colbor. Col <laughs> cobalt purple marl. That's tough to say sometimes. Cobalt purple marl. Please comment down below if you've tried these and what were your thoughts? Do you feel a difference? Retro, what do you know? So Bay did this little thing called convincing me to try the retro jogger set. This is a men's jogger set, mind you. I have a size small here. Fits perfectly oversized. This is super hit or miss for some. I know that. You don't even have to pretend that I don't know that. Where are my retro babes? Okay, that's what I wanna know. Comment down below, raise your hand, shout out loud. Are you a retro loving queen? Better yet, were you born in the 80s or 90s? 89 right here, ayo. <laughs> Let's start with the top. So we have a full zip. This is a windbreaker style. Style, you can feel it, okay? It feels like windbreaker material. But on the inside here, it's a little bit softer. You know, it's not plush, but it softens up a bit so it's not so harsh and cold on the skin. It is double layered. This adds to the quality, which I'm gonna get into in just a second because this quality is spot on. You have the colors black, dewberry purple, soft berry, which you saw in my last video, the training bra. So there's things that match this when it comes to Gymshark, and core blue. So if you have any different pieces, maybe bottoms that'll go with this. I know I saw a gal that commented that she loves the jacket, but not so much the joggers. I guess a full matching set could be a lot. And plus the price is pretty steep. There's no, no getting around that, okay? I think this whole set in USD is like 150, right? like 70 bucks each. So it's a lot of money. You have to love the retro look and want to rep it to make that purchase. If you're not in the US, I noticed that in a different country or two, they actually launched this in a tan color palette, like super neutral. And I was like so jealous because I'm like, I think I like that one more. <laughs> I, de I definitely do. Now they do have two zippered pockets. You have ribbed cuffs all around. And then you have this logo on the back here. This is the standout part of this entire jacket. So this is a really big, outline Gymshark text logo in white. Has a sporty feel. Makes me feel like I'm repping a team on the back or a player. So we have the long form text and the short form here, both embroidered, sewn in really nicely. The joggers, they mix it up. So we have the embroidered shark face right on the leg. And on the back, they actually have the long form right here stitched. You also have two zipped pockets on the joggers as well, ribbed cuffing. Overall, super comfortable to wear. I can't even stress that enough. When squatting down, nothing's really moving, shifting. It's very, very comfortable for more of that windbreaker style. Now the joggers don't have too much stretch in the waistband. It only goes so far, see? Mm and then you're just done. Pull them up right past your hips, nice and high-waisted. They sit nicely. They don't dig, they're not uncomfortable. Now, would I pick these over my lifting essentials? Hell no. <laughs> Capital hell no. I love my lifting essentials and my rest day, which I'm literally wearing right now. I'm wearing last year's rest day in that cinnamon swirl color. I forget the name of it, but you know, it's Halloween week. We gotta rep that pumpkin spice. Overall, really nice fit, okay? For men's, okay? Comment down below your thoughts though. I wanna know what you think of this retro jogger set. Now, if I had to choose one or the other, I'm obviously gonna go with the jacket. Okay, you can pair this with a lot of things. Black leggings, joggers I'm about to share with you in a second. Now for something that's gonna probably be a little more acceptable universally, these are the training fleece joggers and matching fleece crew sweater in dewberry purple. Does that ring a bell? Yes, it does. You can literally wear this dewberry purple with that dewberry purple. 
Now I grabbed them in my size small. These are oversized. I'm happy to see that. You do not need to go up a size or two. They're perfectly oversized. Gorgeous relaxed fit. Now if you want something a little more cozy, a little more subtle, this is it. You have a full fleece lining. So really ultra soft, super stretchy waistband. This is perfect if you're a college student, if you're lounging at home, watching Netflix, working from home, you do a lot in this. And if you wanna dress it up, put on some Uggs. Now I'm not usually a purpley person, but there was something about this particular shade. This could be more of an evening purple. This is dope. Come winter time, I'll be living in this even more. You can size down if you want. I would not. I love that oversized fit. Okay guys, so what are your thoughts? I know I didn't showcase a ton in this video. Like I said, this was kind of a last minute throw together video. I really just wanted to touch base on this vital. Hopefully it's like this from here on out. We'll see. I don't know. With Gymshark, it could... There's no telling. I hope you guys found this video helpful and enjoyable to watch. Thank you so much for being here. I love you guys, and I'll catch you in my next video. Gymshark Marl coming up. Mic check, mic check. Mic check. This does not, does that go? Does this go? There's nothing in this, bro. Can you fill it up for what? Please, thank you. My bad. You couldn't feel that there was nothing in it? If you guys watch my Gymshark videos, you would know the Vital 2.i, I? 2.i? Please let me know so I can... I lost my train of thought. Are you a retro brain? Anyways, I was pleasantly surprised with Vital 2.0 Cobalt Purple Pro. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say it CPM, again. CPM, baby, CPM. <laughs> not even gonna, not even gonna go there.